In this video, I will show you how you can set automatic replies on WhatsApp based on the choice your user will send as a WhatsApp response. So here you can notice I have sent this message where I'm asking the question which place you would like to travel. Kerala, Shimla, Manali. Reply with the name of the place and we will send you the brochure. Thanks. And as soon as I have replied here as Kerala, as soon as the user has replied as Kerala, the same city brochure has been sent as an automatic reply now you can also automate these whatsapp replies but before i show you the whole process firstly i will show you how these replies will work in real okay so i have deleted the existing message now in front of you i am going to send some city name and after few seconds you will see how an automatic reply will be sent along with the same pdf brochure the same city brochure okay so now how we will automate this process so we need three things first a dedicated application for sending the whatsapp message second the file which we are planning to send and third an automation software okay so for sending the whatsapp messages i am using this wati application which is an amazing application because it has the access of official api of whatsapp and in place of wati you can also go with interact ai sensi or any other whatsapp application okay and in the notepad I have already prepared the Google Drive files basically the files the PDF files which I would like to share as a response and in order to automate this process I will use Pabli Connect which is an amazing integration and automation software I am an existing user of Pabli Connect so I am already logged in here you can create your free account in Pabli Connect in just 2 minutes from the sign up free button and in the free account you will also get free tasks to test these kind of amazing automation now once you will log in and reach out to the dashboard of Pabli Connect, click on this blue button that is create workflow and then provide a random name to your workflow to your automation. Okay, so I have directly pasted the name as set automatic reply on WhatsApp with the PDF. Okay, now it is asking to select the folder. So selecting this main workflow folder, clicking on create and after that you will find two boxes. So these boxes are called as trigger and action and here the trigger means when this happens and action means do this. So whenever something happens, happen in your first application then automatically do this in your next application okay so in this way you need to always choose your applications in this trigger and the action window in which you are building an automation okay so according to our use case i want that whenever a new reply is received on whatsapp and as i have told you for sending and receiving the whatsapp messages i will use this vati application so that is why i'm selecting the same application as the trigger application further i want to send the reply Applies on WhatsApp that too automatically and again I will use this Vati application only okay and how I am going to automate this process I will show you everything step by step firstly I am going to connect this Vati with the Pabli connect so that I can capture the responses here all right selecting the trigger event that is configure webhook and as soon as I select this you will notice a webhook URL and few set of instructions okay so you will have to follow these instructions carefully and with the help of this url only we are going to connect our vati with the public connect so that we can capture the responses in public connect okay so copying this webhook url going back to the dashboard of vati clicking on this webhooks option and here you will find the option of add webhook button all right so clicked on that here i am going to paste the same webhook url which i have received via public connect but before i set this new webhook url i think i should delete the existing webhook url or we can say i should delete my existing automation which is already working in the backend using which i have shown you this example okay so give me a second let me disable that automation and then i will show you everything from scratch Alright, so I have disabled my existing automation now selecting the city as enabled and in the event because I want that whenever a new message is received this automation should trigger so I have selected the same event clicking on save and in this way the webhook URL will be saved here successfully that means the connection in Vati and Pabli connect is successful now here you can notice it is waiting for the webhook response okay so read the instructions also now log into the application where you 
you have added the webhook url and do a test submission and record so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response okay so basically it is asking to do our test submission or record and here the test submission means receiving of a new reply here so that i can create a reply for the very same message and then i'm going to post the same reply here okay so i have sent this particular message using wati number only okay so whatever the replies i will received in response to this particular message the same replies will be received here only before that i am going to delete the existing messages all right give me a second i'll show you everything step by step all right so i have deleted the same now whatever the message i will send here as a reply the same data will be received here for which it is already waiting so how about i type the city name as kerala pressing enter now you will notice the automated reply will not be received because i have already disabled my existing automation coming back to the dashboard of pabli connect and here you can notice the response is received and in this response firstly i have the phone number of the person who has replied us back well this number is useful because we want to send the replies also and we are going to send the replies on this particular number only okay scrolling down and here we have the type as text and we have other details also and in this text you can find the reply which we have actually received okay so based on this text only we are going to send the further replies okay so the presence of this data clearly shows that the connection in between wati and pabli connect is working absolutely fine so in this way the first step of our automation is done now moving further i am going to set the whole scenario that if the response received as kerala what should be done if the response received as shimla how the file of shimla should be picked up and sent automatically and if the response is received as manali how once again the file should be picked up automatically and sent as a reply and if we are not getting any of these replies what should be the default message okay so coming back to the dashboard of pabli connect and before we set this automatic reply step we are going to add one more action step that is lookup okay well lookup is an amazing feature of pabli connect via which you can create different kind of automated conditions okay so in the action even i'll set the same i'll select the same that is lookup table clicking on connect and it will be connected immediately now it will ask you to select the lookup key okay so as the name suggests you can understand we are going to look up for a value so basically we are going to look up for the text which we have actually received via our whatsapp response okay so we have received the response as kerala remember we have received the response as kerala let me even show you the same the same reply we have received here that is kerala so we are going to look up for the text we have received if the text received as kerala what should be done we are going to set the whole scenario here so first of all i am going to add the same response here and the interesting thing is i am not going to manually copy the above reply and paste below again and again i am going to map it so that this text will be changed automatically when my automation will work in real time or in next time okay so searching for the very same text all right so i have added the same so let me tell you this once again that whatever the details we will map here from the drop down these details will be changed will be replaced automatically when our automation will work in real time and if you will provide any detail manually here that detail will remain same okay so this is the difference in providing the values via mapping and via manually and that is why mapping plays a major role inside this automation now it is asking for the fall back value so before we provide fall back value i'll show you how we can set the whole condition okay here you can notice this plus and minus sign so click on this plus sign two more times because we are setting up the scenario for three cases one for kerala second is for manali third is for shimla so in the label i will be adding the name of the text basically i will be adding the reply that if 
the reply received as kerala what should be sent so here in the value i will be pasting the kerala file all right give me a second let me paste the same so basically with the help of this lookup table we are matching the values okay so if the reply is received as kerala for kerala this value should be sent this file should be sent now once again if the reply is received as shimla then what value what file should be sent so in front of shimla i will be pasting this particular file and lastly i will set the same scenario for manali as well and again i will paste the same drive link here all right so in this way i have set up the whole scenario with the help of this lookup table i hope you have understood firstly i'll click on this button so that i can show you how a response will be received and in the response you will receive the value of your file okay so remember the lookup key this time was kerala so that is why it has provided the response of kerala only when next time the reply received as shimla in the response we will receive the values related to shimla in this way our automation will take place but there could be one more case what if the customer is neither replying kerala nor shimla nor manali it he is replying some other thing in that case i want to send a predefined message something like please select a city from above options and send us a reply with the name of the city so if customer will not select any of the option we will receive this particular fallback value as a response and in this way this particular message will be sent well currently we have just defined the values we have not automated the replies yet for automating the reply you will have to connect this wati application with the pabli connect once again okay so i have added the same in the action even i will select the send message well because i am not sending a dedicated template message so i can also go with the send a session message because i just want to send a single line message only okay so i have selected the same clicking on connect clicking on add a new connection and for the connection it is asking for the end point and the access token okay so this is the dashboard of varti here you will find the option of api docs and here only you will find both the things that is the access token let me copy the same and paste the same here asking for the end point as well and we have the end point as this let me copy copy and once again paste the same here clicking on save and in this way my wati account will be connected with the pabli connect immediately now it is simply asking for the whatsapp number to which you want to send a message and the text which you want to send as a message so remember we have already received the whatsapp number of the person who has sent us a reply so i am going to map the same number give me a second all right so i have mapped it successfully fully scrolling down and now it is asking for the message text okay so remember we have already set the whole scenario here whole condition here i just need to map this particular response and based on the response the message will be sent clicking on this button save and send test request going back to my whatsapp web and waiting for the reply to be received and here you can notice because the response received was kerala so that is why an automatic automatic reply has been sent along with the kerala pdf file let me even open the same file whether it is actually the brochure of kerala or not give me a second and yes it is the same file okay now how about in place of kerala i provide the file name as shimla and you will see the same city brochure will be received here all right fingers crossed waiting for the message and the reply has been received okay so in this way with the help of pabli connect you can automate your whatsapp replies well it is as easy as 1 2 3 you just need to create this automation workflow inside pabli connect once after that 
that you can sit back and relax because Pabli Connect will take care of all the tasks in the back and you do not have to do anything manually. And basically with the help of this lookup table, we have set this whole scenario, whole condition that if the response received as Kerala, this file should be received in this particular response and we have already mapped this response in our message text as our message text okay so i hope you have understood everything and just in case if you want to access this three-step automation workflow inside your public connect account i will also attach the link of my automation workflow into the description box so simply click on this link sign up for free to the public connect and then you will be able to access the same workflow inside your own public connect account that too for free not just these applications you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with pabli connect you can ask your queries at forum.pabli.com my team will surely answer to your questions this is the website of pabli connect and for the latest updates of pabli connect and unique automation ideas you can join our facebook group that is formget.deals if you have found this video helpful in any way share it with your friends and colleagues and also help them to automate their business like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video